6, this is Grant Hudson, CKLW 2020 News. A gang of fishing this afternoon pulled up something they weren't planning on for dinner. The kids were fishing in the canal over there, and uh, uh, they spotted something wrapped in a blanket. And it wasn't the first time this thing was spotted, I know, before, a day or so ago. One of the kids mentioned it. But uh, this time, it came up to the surface, I guess, and one of the kids got his hook caught in it. It turned out to be a rotting body. Eyewitness Charles Evans tells the 2020 hotlines that stiff sank to the bottom then. That's when police were called in. The worm-baited hook belonging to Victoria Finley, who tells what that floater looked like. He was black. She had short hair, and she had um, a rag tied around her neck, and she had a um, hook um, tied around her legs, and her hands was tied up. That thrilling catch pulled from the water along Harding between Jefferson and the canal. Wayne County Sheriff Bill Lucas having a stiff of his own to worry about. That body located south of Ecorns in Van Buren Township. The man shot in the head right through the blanket he was wrapped in. His body was found in an open field. The Wayne County Sheriff's detectives are currently investigating to try to identify him. It's interesting that in his pocket at the time was found a police type badge which he apparently used to identify himself. Grim Reaper sharpened side striking in Trenton today an unidentified boy about three or four years old felled by flying hot lead on a target range. That young life snuffed out when he rounded a hill and caught a bullet in the head. Hotline news you know to the big eight. Anytime, 24 hours a day. We wait for your call at 254-CKLW in Windsor, 961-NEWS in Detroit. We offer a weekly cash award and once each year, $1,000 for the big story. CKLW